Okay, what I got here and I want to talk about um, real quick is uh, Honda uh, Civics cords maybe um, out there. They get a uh, P1259 VTEC malfunction code. Um, I just want to talk about that code real quick and what you might end up having to do. But first I would start by uh, checking your oil. You want to make sure your oil is full. Um, if you don't have the proper level of oil in the engine, then it's, it, there's a chance it could trick this uh, malfunction code, uh, light problem on, whatever, etc. So I'd start by making sure your oil is full. If not, then even change the oil, get some fresh oil up in there, see what happens. And if that still don't work, then you might be looking at swapping this whole little guy out, which is located on the back of the engine. It's, uh, stand, it stands up like this, folded on the back side towards the passenger right below the, where the EGR valve is. This is off the four cylinder model, uh, 23 I believe, and uh, probably around an 01. And it ha had the same similar code where we checked the oil on that. The oil ended up being uh, fine and you know there's nothing wrong with that so that didn't solve the problem. So we ended up changing out this whole little unit here. We were thinking about just changing the top part of it first but out of recommendation um, we changed the whole unit and uh, fixed the problem. So. This is what you guys might be looking at, having to get into if you want to fix that problem on your car and uh, get that light out. You might just want to try buying one of these and swapping the whole thing out to see what happens. Because, you know, if the oil changes don't work or the oil level is full, then more than likely you're going to have to swap this. Like I said, look right below towards the passenger side firewall, uh, towards the, like the back of the engine, I guess, there. Uh, look down, you'll see it's like right by the EGR valve. At least that's where this one was at on the engine that I swapped it off of. And, uh, it did fix the problem for that car, and I feel that's probably more likely what you're going to have to do. And it is hard hard to get to these bolts, so uh, remove the EGR valve. Makes it just a little bit easier to get to them. And uh, get yourself a nice little quarter inch uh, socket set with a 10 millimeter, a couple of different size uh, extensions. Because uh, it's tight getting to them, a couple little bolts, especially the bottom one, it's probably the hardest. But uh, like I said, it sits back there like this, and uh, you'll see it, like sort of right by the EGR valve, kind of below it. Swap it out, and that might fix your P1259 or PO1259 VTEC malfunction code that you have going on. Thanks for watching. Uh, hopefully this uh, this gave you some help, and, uh, and this is what that the solenoid looks like. This is what you're looking for. When, when you uh, have the VTEC malfunction code, this is exactly what you want to find. Something similar. I think the newer models, they changed it a little bit. So, like I said, hope the video helps you out. And uh, thanks for watching.